Hello everyone, it's Peter here, Piotr Fisner. How are you doing guys? Hello. So, in today's episode we will be talking about donations. And I'll give some update as well. So, I received a Nintendo Switch, which customer brought in because there was no fan spin. And usually when you follow the coders channel, you would know what to do. Unfortunately, this time this didn't work and I said I can investigate it uh, because the voltage is coming but unfortunately the PWM signal signal no so I could I could switch on permanently uh, the fan okay I could switch it on that would be achievable or find the fault but <clears throat> customers said they did they don't want to fix it and uh, they will come and collect it and then I said okay please don't ban it because you know we we teach new people in new areas we want to have branches across the whole country and we want to teach as many people as we can fixing electronics and then cooperate with us and give the service five-star rated across the country so customer said keep it I'll come and collect joy -Con. so We've got it, we've got it for spurs, which is a good thing. So, if that wouldn't be enough, customer, another customer brought in two boxes. I don't know what it is. I don't know. She said it's electronics and that's all I know. How much truth is in that? Let's find out. I got no idea. Is there any value in it or not? I see some cables. So maybe it will be only cables and that's it. Oh gosh. So we, we see BNC connectors and usually it means CCTV. And here is a cam, CCTV cam. There are power supplies, another cam. Another power supply. So these are complete. And at the bottom is some material, so it's not something. And there is a third one. So three of the cameras. Okay. As I said, I didn't know. And what's in the second one? More cameras? No idea, literally no idea what it is. You can skip, I can't even skip. Oh, that's, that's an old uh, phone and two of them. So what we can do with them actually is I can plug in because I've got one, uh, one, two phones, one Polish and one British, soft phones, and I could, I could create a network uh, here for the living room and the top, so that children can pick up. We can call them in, in, in instead of shouting. And the second phone which, which I have, which we were using in the past, I could use for, for the second line. Oop, that's some phone. HD screen. 100 times, whatever 100 times means. I've got no idea what it is and to be true user handbook power let key it's nowhere written what the phone is I don't know what the phone is Wi-Fi or what don't know what it is model s20 ultra but that that doesn't ring a bell that it's a s20 ultra 
at something else. What it is? No idea. It has a screen protector, that's definitely. That's looking weird. So will it even... Uh, let's leave it on a charge. That's, a, that's okay. Still recording, still recording. Oh, that's micro USB. That's the wrong cable. So it's an older phone. As I said, it doesn't look like the S20. It's taking 5.2 volts, 0 0.2 amps. So there is an issue with charging, for sure. Again, I don't know what the phone is, and and I, do, I didn't. I didn't know, I didn't ask, so probably they bought a new S20 Ultra and this one wasn't working. Hey ho! Oh, that's another something. Wow! Headphones. Whoopa Gundam style! That's another uh, stuff for the headphones. Here. Wow, that's not electronics. Okay, missing those pots here, small for the eyes. The mouse, some old power supply, Toshiba, which... Linda something. That's unusual jack connector weird jack connector okay that's telecom oh I haven't seen those for many years so here is just bunch of random things literally it's not something really interesting probably okay and here is some speaker it's looking like a speaker because that has 3.5 no jack portable bluetooth speaker okay and that's it that's it and then jack to jack cable which actually i was needing i meant to buy this cable now i know i had this you know i knew to not buy it i knew <sighs> crystal ball told me no but i for real i had a i had a gut feeling to not buy this cable not i i was i meant to click on ebay buy it now and you know what this was telling me don't do it don't do it universe is working on that one you keep focus on the right i don't know if that speaker is working i don't know anything about those things here okay cables antenna cables so aerial yes uh, rca connectors and some power leads Oh look, if I wouldn't have one enough, I've got second one. Buy one, get one free. Earphones. Ah, that's card. Card cable. And those, and I have those. RCA to, to something else. And plus, oh, big jack to small jack, stereo. I'm using it for keyboard or guitar. This is stereo, so this is this is good for the keyboard. I'll leave it here. Uh, sometimes some DJ equipment, you know. It's it's useful. Actually, this is useful. Remote from something, and I don't watch the telly, so it's not for me. Okay, so TV Onyx. Then there is an aerial antenna in, T and out, in and out, 
power and two SCART cables. Okay, looks like power supply to me. Maybe we can hack it. If I would have time, of course. Yeah. Maybe we could hack it. Maybe find the UART in it and maybe use it for something else. Okay, what's that? Gear 4. Street Party 3. And for the iPod. Yes. Or maybe early iPhones as well. And another iPod speaker. Bush. One Bush does plenty. Oh. Okay, that's supposed to be iPod. Yeah, iPod speaker. Well, hey ho. Okay, old Samsung. Ooh, really old iPod. Mm -hmm. That's HDMI and micro USB connector. Here is LAN connector. I don't have idea if anybody knows what it is. Let me know down in the comment because I've got no idea. But HDMI jack, micro USB, LAN, I've got no idea guys. What do you need it for? For the network you would put HDMI. I've seen those solutions but it depends on the quality of the picture you want to send. Now TV. Everybody knows what Now TV is. So. That's a hub too. And the last one. Now TV Hub, let's get connected. And another one. Yes. So for those who don't know, this is a router. Yes. Pretty much you connect it to the network and then you use it to, well, that's adapter and uh, filter and the cable. So what it is, is you've got a broadband here, comes in and you've got a Fernet 1, a Fernet 2, and you've got an OTV player built in, I'd say. Should, should be hackable. This should be hackable. Hopefully I can find it. Uh, I mean, find the time to do it. That's it, guys. That's everything. 13 minutes. Yeah, so one Nintendo Switch and plus this. Uh, recording! Okay, guys, so from the update, we've got a new guy starting in Marvel Well to learn. I'm, I just fixed one wardrobe here. Well, now it's shelves. And uh, all the stuff went away. I fixed it and I can put customers' stuff when, they, when we receive it. And uh, then once it will be dealt with here and will be tidy then I can move on to the rest and the rest and the rest and we're starting tidying up I brought in 24 volts from downstairs now so I've got 24 volts and two batteries connected here not one and I still have problem with running this PC on the inverter those inverters which I bought are rubbish and I don't want to uh, I don't want to use them and uh, what I wanted to say is uh, I, I've used thicker wires because we've got 24 volts now, 12 volts transfers transferred up here. This should be more amps and th these inverters should work well, yes? Uh, 
but still yes still i can run my monitor i can run microscope i can run soldering iron when it comes to my pc this doesn't want to for some reason so i i gave up for now because i need to find time uh, and i don't have this time i want to tidy up first that's for me most important and landlord agreed to the solar panels even on the roof if i would want it and i can put at the back on the shed i can put at the front he cut off three trees uh, these were like apple trees the size of apple was like that so you know so this didn't produce you know quality fruits or anything so it, it was a waste only in shade and everything so he fixed and fixing still the fence it's lower so it's a space for solar panels so we can put more solar panels here in this way uh, probably a year will take me to build everything the way I want because of the you know money doesn't grow on the trees otherwise I would keep my trees here <laughs> and I can say that in a one year time we will spend enough money to build a system that our house could be off grid yes apart from maybe the shower because the shower is a problem so yes when it comes to the shower it's 9.6 kilowatts and i won't be building so many batteries to sustain that power because that would be a small fortune but there are other ways to heat up your uh, water and take a bath for instance rather than take a shower so you know in the summer quick shower even cold shower if you like because i like cold showers so it can be even that done so you know we will find the ways we will see i'm giving myself one year and then i'll decide if i want a wind turbine after a whole year so that's mean this season next season and then i'll decide if i want a wind turbine or i will just stick to the solar uh, photovoltaics uh, we've got one guy helping me here all the time. I will ask him if he want to be mentioned or shown on the video as well And one other guy is helping me for quite a bit of a time now. So it's three people working here not one Plus Asha is from marketing. She's making the thumbnails for the videos and Plus web dev team is working on the book repair um, online.co.uk all the time now shop is added while we speak as well and quite a few changes have been made inside the software will be will be statuses updated and uh, i will be able to manage the statuses myself so i can add more statuses as an admin rather than asking web development team to always do something when i come up with a new idea or speaking with clients who are using book repair yeah. and yes yeah, so this year we will still have a shop and the next year will be probably version 2.0 with custom domains so every repair shop will have booking system inventory system shop <coughs> customer related stuff uh, and chat in general plus support is built in we'll have forum because forum is built in and working now this shop is finished and will be as well custom domain that's the two things and uh, mm, and the page if somebody want www page so for the custom domain you will have your custom page so it will be all in one solution if you run a repair shop or you want to cooperate with us uh, yes so you will have one stop shop for everything and you don't have to worry backups are, are automatically made um, so everything is fine and no issues you can say yes so yeah that's all the updates there is we are building now for the transport company app and for the school for martial arts and um, school to manage their business so yes we will have more software coming up to rent as well for people and we are planning to build even more and rent it of course yes so yeah that's a lot of work here done and we're opening ourselves to the new area so i'm finding new people now who can start to learn fixing within the car reach so i can go and i can do micro soldering stuff and they can open clean uh, test it yes after or before 
so yes, yeah, so if anybody is uh, close to us and would like to cooperate with us, uh, feel free to do so because we're growing customers and we would like to join new partners as well to fix stuff with us, learn with us, have one supplier for certain things. Yes, then if we need to have M92 T36 chips and we can't find them, we go to Alibaba getting samples and if we see these chips are working we're ordering 1000 of them this way we've got always a good quality and good price because we're integrated yes that's what is at the back here as you know let's make it with inter team and yeah and that's the plan guys so thank you for watching if you like what we're doing leave us a like button and see you in the next video bye bye